In this tutorial, I will show you how to set up your wiki within your Sakai site. So under wiki, you'll see that I've already made some changes on the home page. To do this, you'll need to click edit. And here is my entry that I've already put in. And just so you know, to get help on the wiki, on the far right side there's wiki tips. So here you learn how to create a new page, format your text. You can also click more hints on wiki formatting. And here, a table is displayed for all the simple text formatting that you might want to do, including adding new links, displaying it as bold, strike throughs, list items. And you also are given a lot of different macros and other things that you might be able to do within the wiki. So let's go back home. So I'm going to edit this page. And under group pages, I'm going to use the notation to create a new page, which is an open bracket the name of the page, close bracket. Then I'm going to save. Now that page appears. Now it has a question mark next to it because that page does not contain any content at the moment. So let's go in and edit this page. So we'll delete this default text. So let's say we want group one to report on the United States presidents. So let's do a heading. And this will be heading one and we'll say US presidents. So now there's a heading there. And when your students come in and access this wiki, they can come in and edit this as well as you. And they could add Abraham Lincoln. And that'll be a new page. And when that page is created, you can then begin to put all the content there. So under Abraham Lincoln, we'll come in and edit this. This is what you or your students can do but I'm going to add an image that's already been uploaded into Sakai. Use that button there and I have an image called Lincoln.jpg. I'm going to select that. It's now under items to attach. I'm going to continue and this is the link used within the wiki to reference that image that we just uploaded. So we'll save that and now the image of Abraham Lincoln is here and the entire page is fully customizable by you and your students. So let's return home and let's say you want to upload a wiki rubric here. So also to edit here you don't just have to use the add an image to add an image. You can also use it to upload a file. So I, I don't have my wiki rubric in here so what I can do is I can go over here to add, upload the file, choose file, my wiki rubric, upload that file now, and that is under items to attach. Continue. Now there's a link under the wiki edit page. Save that. And now when I click on this, I can go see the wiki rubric. Refresh the wiki. And that's the wiki. You can give comments as well as create different content for your students and give feedback for the content that they create. It's really a fully customizable area. You and your students can post the different content that might be needed for the class or use it as a discussion. Either way, thank you.